The city of Aurora fired Chief Vanessa Wilson in April, less than two years after she officially got the job. The city manager's termination letter says, I have lost trust and no longer have full confidence in your ability to lead the department, with concerns about her leadership and management. In a notice of claim filed September 23rd, Wilson's attorneys claim she was fired because she was carrying out court-ordered reforms, a consent decree that followed the death of Elijah McClain and allegations of racist policing. If that was the reason they fired her, certainly it would be retaliatory and unlawful. Nine News legal expert Whitney Trailer says this legal letter is a required step before somebody sues the government. Most of these type of cases settle and something of this public uh, I would I would be surprised if it didn't settle because you have to remember when you go to a jury trial, it's in their hands. The letter lists examples when Wilson disciplined or fired white officers for their conduct toward people of color. After her firing in April, she defended her management and leadership. It's about making sure that we have leaders in police departments in this city, in this state, and across the country that are willing to stand up to the unions, that are willing to stand up to people that are doing it wrong and are willing to fire officers that are doing it wrong. Wilson made enemies. This letter also mentions a newly elected conservative council member who publicly called her trash and accused Wilson of making the city unsafe. And it claims Wilson was fired for prioritizing community involvement and for her association with and advocacy for people of color. A city spokesperson says Wilson was not fired for following the consent decree reform platform and that the city is still engaged with and making progress on that decree. The city says Wilson was instead fired for ineffective management and low employee morale within the department. Wilson's letter, by the way, also points out that the two interim chiefs and the three finalists for the new chief full time job were all white men. Mm. So, I mean, maybe this goes to court have has a long procedure or maybe they just cut her a check. It, who knows? Uh, our legal expert says oftentimes these things lead to a settlement. So we shall see. Jenny, thank you.